What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel for another episode of In the Kitchen with Retro. Just got a short video today, but I already got my ingredients out. Sugar, heavy whipping cream, and some vanilla, pure vanilla extract. What are you up to today? I'm making some whipped cream for my pumpkin pie, right? For my pumpkin pie that I forgot to make on Thanksgiving, right? It's like Thanksgiving was here and, you know, had all the other had the whole meal, you know, set to, uh, set, and, uh, you know, it turned out fine, but then it's like, oh, yeah, crap, forgot the, I forgot the Marie Callender's pumpkin pie, it's still in the freezer, so, <laughs> we didn't get to have, thanks, pumpkin, I didn't get to have pumpkin pie on Thanksgiving, so it's a little late, but hey, better late than never, right, so, yeah, I still, I got the pie, I baked it, so I don't have any Cool Whip, so I'm making my own because I use the heavy whipping cream for um, you know to make my own like uh, ranch dressing and stuff. So that's what I I always have you know the heavy whipping cream anyway. So there you go. That's those three ingredients. So I need to make uh, Cool Whip or whipped cream. So that's what we're doing. Let me get the tripod set up. All right, we're back, guys. So this should be a quick video. Not too, not too many steps, really. So just get my whip, whipping cream here. It's unopened. Might need a knife. Oh. Some of these are childproof, you know. <laughs> and yes, that is Airwolf playing in the background. The Airwolf theme song. Found a, found a video where someone. This is like a. This ain't the original. It's like they, they did a cover of it. Alright, so got my whipping cream. Shake it real good. Cool thing about it is basically just add however much you want. Because you don't. It thickens on its own, so you don't have to add anything. It ain't like you gotta come up with a. You know, like a formula, like so much of it and then so much of this to make it thick. It's like the whip, the cream th thickens on its own. Alright, so I'm just going to put a uh, teaspoon of sugar in, right? That's it. I'm going to stir that in first before adding the vanilla. Now one important tip from my research is make sure your 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 whipping cream is cold, cold, cold right out of the fridge, okay? Don't, don't let it set out. I guess it thickens up better um, if it's cold, okay? All right. So just a little, uh, some vanilla extract there a little bit of splash of fun you know so locked and loaded here I'm gonna start out on slow Yeah, I think you can do it by hand. It would just take a lot longer, probably. You know, because how it thickens up is, you know, by by the speed. Here, let's go. We're going on level two. <laughs> Start out on level one, but now we're on level two, baby. So it, it might take a you know a couple minutes doing it this way until it thickens up. Let's test it out right now, just to see. So, there we go. Just, so can you see that? So it's thickened up some, but it ain't ready yet. Gotta do some more whipping. Whip it good, right? <laughs> Thank you. 
Yep, it's coming along now. Try to get up here so you guys can see this. By golly, I think it's ready. I think it's done. Yeah. That's what you call whip it and whip it good, right? <laughs> Like retro, you're out of control. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> now nah, we're good, right? It's just having fun. You gotta have fun with this. So. So this is appropriate plate, right? American flag, old glory. Alright, let's plate up here. All right, we're ready to plate up here. So I got my cool uh, pie server, right? How, how, you can't, I'm, you know, I'm retro and everything, but look, look at this. You, you can't get much more American than pumpkin pie on this American flag plate with some Cool Whip hand with some homemade Cool Whip with the Airwolf theme playing in the background. Now where else are you going to get that, right? I don't think, just retro reviews, that's it. That's the only place you're getting it. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, see that? Nice and thick now, huh? Okay. And for the record, this is my first time. Okay, first time making it. Bam, maybe got a little too much there, but hey. I like a little bit of pie with my whipped cream. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna taste the whipped cream first by itself, you know, just so I can tell you about that. Mmm. Nice. Bam. All right. Let's get in here. Remember the truth. We're how how does it pair with the pie? Hmm. I'm gonna have to say that's delicious. <laughs> Mighty scrumptious. Hmm. <laughs> I think I think I pulled it off. Let me know if you in the comments below. Do you guys do you guys think I pulled this off? Cause yeah, you can see the whip. That's that's thick. That's like cool whip, you know, like you buy in the store. I'm gonna say probably cheaper, right? The thing about it is, you can make it as sweet or whatever as you want. You can, if you want it sweeter, you can put more sugar or more vanilla. That's the cool thing about it. You, you're in control, right? So, there you go. Thought I'd do a cool, um, just a quick video on whipped cream. Whipped cream on a pumpkin pie on an American flag plate with Airwolf playing in the background. That's retro reviews for you, baby. <laughs> so, yeah, that's going to do it for the video. But leave me your thoughts in the comments below. Have you ever done this yourself, or would you ever consider it? Now that you know it's 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 easy peasy, just like that. Three ingredients. Whip it up, and bam! What I did that like in less than five minutes. Okay, just a few minutes of whipping. But yeah, leave me your thoughts in the comments below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But if this is your first time to the channel. Tap the subscribe button down there, then the bell next to it, ding ding, so you're notified when I upload new videos. So until next time, guys, keep it retro! <laughs>